today we will uh, perform a spiritual seance and when no one responds and nothing is summoned, Foxy will realize that uh, his imaginary friends are imaginary friends. And they can't die, especially not be killed by one another. Welcome, traveler! I am Madame Zloy and welcome to my parlor! We have ourselves a murder to solve and a ghost to exercise. Zloy, wh why do you make up fancy voices? Look, I just... I, that's how I get into the character, right? It's, it's gonna take some heavy roleplay to figure this storyline out. So get in, and we're gonna we're gonna get going. Uh, fine. Jeez, why are also, we here? <laughs> awfully judgmental for someone who like picked out a skin for this endeavor. <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta be mad. Come on, at least try All right. and be normal. All right. Uh. Just to catch up, you've been having some bizarre supernatural problems with your imaginary friends. Okay, so my name is Foxy No Tail, and I had a friend called Mr. Onion who, who passed away recently. Apparently he wasn't real, but I, I think he was. And then I had another friend that apparently also isn't real called Mr. Barbecue that told me that it, he was eaten by a zombie that looked like me, which I thought was nonsense, to be honest with you. But then other people on the realm started saying that this zombie that looked like me was chasing them and he was cropping up in other people's videos, which I sort of thought was a bit weird, really. So Sloy invited me to his house. I thought we were just going to meet up and, you know, have a chat and a cup of tea and... Yeah, next thing you know, we find ghosts or something. Why, why am I here? So today, sure? yep. we will have a seance to, and we'll attempt to contact the deceased Monsieur Onion and figure out exactly what led to his timely demise. And then we're gonna hunt down whoever killed him and kill them, probably. Well, should, I know. Should, should we not just ask Mr. Barbecue? I mean, he... what does he know? He's also an imaginary friend. <laughs> <laughs> Why does everyone keep saying I've got imaginary friends? Because you too, Fox. Sorry to break it to you, but jeez. Yeah, this is not a seance, actually. This is an intervention. No, just kidding. So, why are we here again, Foxy? I don't, like, I don't know, he just keeps inviting me to his house. I, I kind of so wish he'd stop inviting us to his creepy mansions, like for I, real. I know, is, is he just like flexing? What, what's the issue? I don't know, I know he's a builder person, but like, come on, why does the guy be all creepy? Can't you just build something nice for once? Jeez. I don't know, it's always when it's thundering and lightning as well, it's never on a nice day. I know! I it's, know. Like, it's all haunted apparently too? I, have, I don't know, I don't trust yeah, this guy. Yeah. No, I don't. Something weird going on. Okay, you yes. stand here, and you stand here, and I'll stand here, and everybody hold hands. I don't care how we can accomplish this, <laughs> but okay. let's. I, I think okay. that's gonna break our arms, Loy. We're not made for this. Yeah. Sorry, I I'm a bit heavy-handed. Okay, <laughs> let's... <laughs> let's dim the light. I say as I go into my, you know, video settings. And <laughs> proceed. Foxy, Ooh. I live here. What is the name of the deceased? Mr. Onion. Is that... Does he not have a full name, like a proper one? Like an <laughs> actual person? Mr. Pierre Onion. Pierre, alright. Mr. Onion and I... We never really actually knew each other very well because we were completely separate people. We didn't really have a great deal to do with each other. But on the times that I did see him, he always seemed to manage to get money out of me and items. And he always seemed to win one over on Slack as well, which was quite interesting, really. He was a, he was a, he was a bit of a wheeler dealer. He was a good character. He was a, I think he had a, a warm heart, but he just sort of a cold outer shell, really. But uh, yeah, I didn't really know him because he was absolutely nothing to do with me and I didn't have yeah, anything uh, to do with him. Did he not attempt to trap you in a world of dreams uh, that one time in Season Zero? You... potentially. That, 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 the rumours are that is the case, but um, I'm not... I can't confirm or deny that at this particular moment in time. It's speculation at best. You were literally the only one who actually knows that information. Or am I? <laughs> yeah! Friend of mine! 
we've met so many times before. Are you here with us? I have here your dearest friend, Silent Whisper. <laughs> Hi. Fox is here. He wants to know how you died. Come, come to to us, Pierre. Follow the light of my torch. Speak through me, Pierre. Speak through me. I'm sorry, my mouse, my mouse slipped. Uh, speak through me. Yeah, the, the thing that you guys do. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Foxy No Tailors. I right. am Pierre Nonions. What is what is this that you wanted me to know? Are you imaginary? Because everyone yeah. seems to think you're not real. He's definitely uh, imaginary. Yeah. Did you? How did you die? Hello. Yes, it is I, Monsieur Onion. And I am occupying this uh, fairly inconvenient yet incredibly handsome and very physically strong body. I think my host, uh, as in the host that the, of the body I am for that. Very interesting person and definitely very smart and probably doesn't just eat chips all day. It's very clear that this person obviously goes to gym every other day. So yes, as a person, as a also very French, as you can probably tell by my very French accent. So, overall, on being dead, I would probably not recommend it. Um, definitely, like, it's up there in my top 10 experiences, but only because my life was fairly painful up to the point I died. How did you die? Miserably. Also, you saw Right, okay, so see you later, guys. I've got things to do. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, oh. can you come back? I yeah. was actually just making this stuff up, like pretending the entire time that I, you I mean, don't that wasn't real. Think... Yeah, Zola, I think I... we need to have an intervention. I think you're like having multiple personalities or something. Yeah. No, no, I was just it's pulling you away, guys. I don't think I can summon the spirit. But don't worry, Perfect. I have a plan B, and that's why you are here. So, would you say you believe in Supernatural? Oh yeah, definitely. It was a very good series. Uh, you know, back in the earlier seasons, it had a lot of potential, but now I'm like on season 12, and like, they killed Crowley, spoilers, and it's just kind of going downhill, getting a little bit bland, you know? So, uh, overall, it's like, it's like a still an 8 out of 10. I have a plan B, and that's why you are here. Me? I, I was wondering when we are going to get to that point. Seems kind of yeah. irrelevant. <laughs> so, Foxy. Yes. Mr. Silent over here is a Red Stoner Extravaganza. So, so I've heard. So I've heard. Yeah. Which is That's why, why the server lags. Because <laughs> 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 nothing works because it's expert at Redstone. Good job. Don't yeah. worry. Yeah. Today we have a very simple task for him and for ourselves. I commissioned Monsieur Silent over here to create for us a redstone powered Ouija board that will allow us to contact the dead. Excellent. This seems like a really sensible thing for us to be doing. Yep. Isn't that like super 1990s like horror movie? Jeez. Hey, uh, I'll have you know the movie Ouija uh, Origins of Evil came out in 2018. Oh, okay, this is perfectly relevant then. But uh, yeah, I'm just gonna put down like a dropper. There you go. You're welcome. I, That'd I be 90 that diamonds. We've got a really like, really good thing going on here, but why don't we play Jumanji instead? <laughs> I like Jumanji. That could because be a good time. the time to execute a Jumanji storyline, Foxy. Oh, right, anyway, uh, we I need a bunch of that. blocks renamed with letters, and we need to somehow manage it. to click it at, all at once. Done. Redstone Ouija board. Talk about it. Yes, so when Zloy originally came to me with that idea, I was kind of like, okay, this is going to be a super complicated contraption. I spent days and Whoops. years uh, and sorry. hours. You broke the thing, Foxy. Ouija, uh, Redstone Ouija board. Uh, how, how did that get? What? <laughs> well, 
I, I honestly have no idea. This isn't really my kind of gig, but for some reason, Zloy wanted like a redstone Ouija board, and that's not a thing that you make in Minecraft. That is just weird. So I had to spend days and hours of thinking up a design for it, and then I was just like, eh, too lazy for that, so I just like put a dropper, and that appeared to work. All right, so for our enjoyment, Silent Whisper here prepared a redstone Ouija board, which is actually just a dropper with a button, but if we press the button, all together, then there can't be possibly a third party. Actually, there can't be any interference from any of us. That would no. mean that it is Mr. Onion or whatever spirit we're channeling yeah. that is trying to communicate. So, okay. my friends, aim your, you know, the, the, the crosshairs onto the button and shut up. On three, <laughs> one. Two and three. <gasps> okay, what does we it have say? a letter? We have a letter. Did it, it actually says, work? M. 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 Money. M. Money. Mister. M. M. Death. Death. Yeah, probably. But we, <laughs> we could probably just keep Mine? keep pushing because what? Monkey. Majamas. Marfa. Uh, yeah, that's mustard. I, it, Mayonnaise, yes. <laughs> no, murder. <gasps> no, no, I don't dun, think so. dun, dun. <sighs> yeah, actually, we have like a bunch of other letters. Let's just press another yeah. time. Okay, okay. okay. on three, so every remove th this letter. Otherwise, we're gonna get confused. There we go. Come on, Zvog. One, yeah, and a two, and a go. I can wait. Oh, I didn't do it. Sorry, it's but fine. Get it's out? fine. This thing is random, regardless. So right, okay. So what we got? Oh, it's <gasps> definitely money. Or oh. or hear me out. He yeah. instead wants to play Monopoly. Monopoly. He has or a point. That Jumanji, but spelt wrong. <laughs> I mean, he is French. Exactly. That's how they spell it in France. I know. I think the M and the O is M for Mr. and O for Onion. So Mr. he onion. is communicating and confirming his identity. Yes. Which proves that he's not my imagination, and therefore I'm right and you're all wrong. Ha! In your or face. Or is this completely random and you're just getting lucky? Potentially. That, yes. But very unlikely at this point. Three times in a row. On three. One. Two and go. Three. What is it? It's another O. Another O. Moo. Mo. Moo. Money. Moo? It says ghost. Is it? It's how ghosts. Are. Money. <laughs> like that. He wants money. I owe moon? him rent. <laughs> it's all coming out now. Oh, I wish we'd never done this. Now I feel guilty that I never paid him that last bit of rent. Wait, you yeah. owe him rent? Yeah, for the shop it, above the his shop, the room no, above okay. his Wait. shop. I. Yeah. Do you put your money from like left pocket into the right pocket, or, or like the other way what? around? How is that? And what? <laughs> he's he's his own unique. He used to be at least his own very unique person with his own very unique pockets. Nothing to do with mine. Oh, I'll right, have you yeah, know. Sure. He even had his own end of chest and everything. So, if I had to give a review for this particular exorcism and like monster hunting murder mystery, uh, I would say that Zloy is, I, I don't know, he's not very good. I had to do more of the exorcism myself than he did, and he's the self-proclaimed psychic. Although the Ouija board, that did work out pretty well, I'm pretty happy about that. Great redstone contraption there, amazing design. Um, but overall, eh, I don't know, maybe 2 out of 10 for this exorcism and psychic lesson. Overall, would not recommend. Why is, does it say moo? And why does it say anything to begin with, considering that... Oh my god, guys, my house might be haunted. Can I ask a question? <laughs> yeah. Oh, is really? There, what, are they lowercase or uppercase letters? Uh, M is uppercase, U's are lowercase. Right, so it's... Yeah, so it's spelling a word then. Yeah, it might have been or more, now that I think about it. 
Homo. <laughs> it's trying to do o o o but backwards. Upside down M. <laughs> You've holding the paper the wrong way around, Sloy. <laughs> Uh, okay. I told you there could have been typos. Jeez. Uh, what? Did who pressed the button? Where did that come from? I was in my in inventory. I was just sort of idly staring into space. Okay. Yeah. You read it. Uh, you read it. it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it says. Are you ready for this? Moo. Oh come on! You're lying. Let me see that. There you go. Check it out. You I have no idea why read. Mr. Onion wants okay, to make cow noises. Does, Maybe he's trolling it, us. Yeah, it does say um, That's a lot of... Okay. I think... Guys, oh, God. What even is? Guys, there's, uh, <laughs> there's, there's meat dropping on me. Uh, guys. This, this. I, I think your house might actually be haunted, Zoy. Look. But uh, you know what? <laughs> it, it's a free food farm, so like... <laughs> How can you get it all with my food? hopper? I don't have a hopper. Give me a hopper. I will, no, I, I you're not getting not a hopper. prepared for this. <laughs> <laughs> That's my hopper. I'll oh. have you now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see Sly anymore, but I'm getting lots of beef. Okay, I'm rolling meat from the ceiling. Well, it, it's a mildly creepy. However, I do think it's a pretty exploitable feature as well. I'm willing to call that one a feature. Free food, we just need more food. You know, fish, fish are pretty bad. Uh, so yeah, I'm kind of in favor of beef dropping from the ceiling. I think it'd be good for like farming and stuff. So you would not be bothered by farming beef by having your friend live in a consistent terrified state of an otherworldly being that is inhabiting their house. That seems like a fair trade-off. Thank you for the free beef, but um, yeah, I, I don't want to be here anymore. I'm going. Um, yeah, right. guys. I'm, I'm not going to be staying here in this clearly very haunted, dangerous house. Sorry. Okay, yeah. no, like, look, you can't just leave me here during a thunderstorm. <laughs> kind of can. <laughs> yeah, totally can. You, you don't you don't own us. No, Bye. we're leaving. Bye. Um, Sorry. That's good. We gotta, that? we gotta get to the bottom of it. What's that in your fire? It's a wait. What? Why have you got chest in Why your fire? Why do you have a chest? That's a fire. bad idea. It's just gonna set on fire. I never had chest. How the that's, what? That's the worst place to store items I've ever seen. How dare you! You murdered Cheesecake Factory. Is this more free beef? Woo! <gasps> free cooked beef. Cheesecake I Factory that's... remains. What does that mean? Yeah. What's the cheesecake factory? Well, now this might be the. Oh my God! This might be the, the ghost. Now that you're holding it, you're in it with me, <laughs> suckers. I never God. got that egg. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay, I got set on fire by <laughs> lightning. I'm back. I think that's a sign. I think I'll stay. I don't know exactly who cheesecake factory was. Well, probably a cow. And nor like where it what happened, but it obviously was not buried properly, and that's why it's haunting my house. Uh, oh, actually, you know what? I saw a cheesecake factory by Liara's shop in the shopping district. How Clearly. did the cow <laughs> get all the way from the shop and into my fireplace? I think you're asking the wrong question. Yeah. The right question is, how do we get rid of the ghost? Well, if we got a corpse and like of unrested remains. Yeah. Can we just throw Maybe it in it's... fire? I Is think we can just like bury it and that's gonna be it, shouldn't it? Like, is, is that not how that works? Maybe it's got unfinished business, perhaps, I don't know. What unfinished business does a cow even have? Maybe it just wanted to be milked one more time. Okay, we'll do your idea, we'll bury it. This graveyard, why exactly do you have it, would you say? Um. Well, the thing is, last season I died a lot, but this season I've hardly died at all, like maybe 10 times, if that. So I thought, do you know what? It'd be nice to highlight the fact that I haven't died much by building a graveyard for every single one of the times that I've died on and off camera, honest. How many times have you already had to expand the graveyard? Oh, not at all, not at all. The crypt underground is completely empty. There's nothing down there at, at all. Promise. Would you say this is a good place to bury a demonic cow? It's a good place as any. It's almost like it's purpose-built. 
really? Plenty of space because I haven't died much. Um, we are gathered here today to mourn the loss Hey, of... yeah, yeah, hang on a minute. What? How come we're having a nice funeral for a cow none of us knew when we had one for Mr. Funeral? You were just, you didn't, you were horrible. Mr. Because Funeral? one of them is haunting my house and the other not. Right, okay, fine. Anyway, anyway, moving on. Does anyone have any nice words to say about the cow? I mean, it's a um, cow. I, I, I did, never met it. I mean, it, it moved pretty nice. I'll say that. It, it, yeah, it, it nice. haunted yeah. very convincingly. Let's it was good at spelling. Yes. It was a yes. very intelligent cow. Yes. Yeah. I'm quite amazed, actually, that you were able to communicate with it on the other side, being a cow. Well, you know, uh, like-minded cat. Uh, yeah. Look. Let's yeah. bury it. <laughs> just, let, let's just get rid of Wait. it and yeah. what? I, I want to throw that. There we go. Oh, it's, yeah. It's those, like the, yep. those are yeah. also hymns, hairs, theirs. <laughs> Uh, oh, uh, what uh, even is that? Um, alert, hello, uh, behind the uh, grave. Oh, oh my god! Um, yes, so what I, even is that? What's the, what the a, uh, actual uh, what? Uh, running away, running away from um, that thing. That, uh, that's not one of mine. Yeah, sure it is. It, it looks it exactly looks like, like you. That not, that's not one of mine. That's Mr. Okay, Bambi, you said there was a zombie here? that looked like, look, look like me. Is there a fire uh, escape anywhere in this crypt? I, I, it's just for show. It's an aesthetic crypt. It doesn't really work. So, what kind of impact did Cheesecake Factory the Cow have on your life? Uh, guys, uh, he's coming. He's coming. Guys, he's gonna eat. He's gonna, gonna eat us if we don't get him. There's no choice. No, of course, he's gonna eat it if we keep shouting. So, how would you describe uh, feeling of being what? trapped in a cryptum with a zombie uh, version of you clawing at the door? Shut, shut up. There's a. There's literally like the zombies coming. Why are you doing this now? He's here. He's here. Oh, Somebody did that. I don't know. Try and kill him or something. I don't know. Oh. 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 Okay. Uh, well, that was easy. That was easy. I'm a great monster hunter. I Just know, saying. Right? I, I think it's the court. That's a little bit anticlimactic, to be honest. I thought it'd be, like, I don't know. Hey, I mean, dis in my really. book, just two monsters for the price of one. Get rid of a cow ghost. Get rid of a yeah. foxy zombie. It's, it's fine. So what would you say you learned today? Um... Uh, the cat, um, uh, this world's, like, totally cursed, corrupt, something wrong with it. I don't like it anymore. I, yeah, the moon and the, the cows and the, the zombies and the... Uh, am I going crazy? I mean, you, you were there already. Like, you, you, you've been crazy for, like, half a season now. Oh, okay, good. So, what would you say uh, you learned today? Well, first of all, and I think this is the most important lesson, any problem in the entire world can Hang be solved with excessive is, amounts of... <laughs> this is, this is my actually, interview. Is, is he actually dead or not? Because I want to... Yeah, is he dead? I get He's the dead. impression that he used to be dead. Carry on. He was what? All right. <laughs> anyway, yes, any problem in the entire world can be solved with excessive amounts of silence and violence. And and that's second. it. Oh, he, oh, right. he, that's he it. is dead, isn't he? Definitely dead. Get out of my okay. shot! You had your own interview. Sorry. <laughs> 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 and, uh, I feel today I did some great and incredible job. Uh, Mr. No Tails obviously feels more at peace with himself now that we exercised his literal demons. And uh, I also... I think I did a great job. Especially, I liked the part where we got rid of the ghost that was apparently haunting my house. Not a fan of anything that came before or after, though, but uh, definitely quite some productive work has been done. And uh, I feel I earned my spot in the at least top two of the psychic beings over the uh, Truly Bedrock Season 1 realm. You did nothing today. Literally nothing. Did I? Did I? Yeah, you really didn't do anything. Yeah. 
See ya.